Praise Almighty Yahweh for this time we're sharing together. We ask that he would continue to unfold his wisdom and his will being done 
through his people. Father, we thank you for signs, wonders, and miracles. We thank you for the Messiah, the miracles of the Son of God. That was a great miracle, assurance of resurrection, power, and life, Father. We thank you that miracles accompany that Jesus, throughout his public ministry, even Jesus hung on Calvary's cross, wonders took place around him. Father, we thank and praise you for that miracle. The miracle of Jesus marked Christ, the God's messenger, and Jesus' own words marked him as the Son of God. As we begin to pray and we start allowing our mind to let, allow you to come in, giving over total surrender that you would perform your perfect will, confronting every evidence of the, of the claims about himself. We stand uh, in agreement that Jesus, the miracle worker, and wonderful things that uh, would get, be bring the grand miracles of resurrection to each and every life. Jesus heals, and this girl was healed. Jesus delivers how the story unfolds. In some cases, the parties to the miracle will receive, not sent exactly like the lost sheep of the house of Israel, but Jesus at the earlier time had sent his disciples on the preaching mission with the warning, do not go into the way of the Gentiles. Gentiles. Amen. Do not enter a city of the Samaritans, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you, Israel Messiah. His mission required him to consecrate his initial efforts on recalling straying Israel to re the relationship with God. Hallelujah. Through it was the time of the visitation. He quoted, as he said to the woman, let the children be first, filled first. God always intended that the gospel messages have a universal impact, yet it was only right that Jesus should first present himself to Israel as the fulfillment of the prophets, hopes, and dreams. I pray that you will have a great evening. I'm going to reside now and begin to uh, continue to pray. Uh, today, uh, we want to believe in those miracles. We want to discover God's mighty works on behalf of his people. Amen. Everything is really all about his people. The fig tree is blossoming. What are the three grand miracles of Christianity? Do we even want to become part and results of the miracle of an earthquake? You know, he comes in so many ways, you will find complete answers in him and him only through his word. Hallelujah. Father, we thank and praise you for covering all the miracles and wonders from the book of Genesis to the book of Revelation. We thank and praise you for the cultural insights today. Father, we thank you for the way that you bring us constructive criticism. You bring us rebuke, Father, and these things are good for us that we may be able to live a holy life, a set-apart life, Father. A miracle of earthquakes open the prison doors. Glory, hallelujah. A midday of an earthquake, the foundation of the prisons was shaken and the doors swung open and everyone's chains were loosed. Hallelujah. You look at the hand of God move. The prisoner um, keeper rushed to the residence and saw that the prison door was open and he and his suicide attempt reflects the fact that in the Roman Empire, a jailer who let a prisoner escape was to receive the penalty due to the prisoner as well. But we see God work miracles in the Roman uh, culture. Suicide was considered as an honorable uh, alternative. Suicide uh, would prevent the forfeiting of all family in assess that some cases and a man who cared for his wife and children might kill himself to pervert, preserve their inheritance but he could not he could act however Paul shouted out assuring the jailer that we are all here amen the jailer reacted suggests that he had heard the missionary's message he had called been called to the light and called into the 
uh, light into the darkness innermost cell and fell trembling at Paul's feet. This is amazing. I love the story of how that jailer thought he was going to have to die. Rock Lito, thank you for being here. So much of new people are coming. I'm so appreciative to you to be on our Instagram live. And those that are on Facebook live, thank you so much this evening. It is a joy and a pleasure. We're talking about miracles tonight, Rock. We're talking about miracles. Do you hear me? In the Bible, these were miracles that were grand miracles. Amen. And I hope that you will come back to hear more of the sighting of the Word of God in terms of miracles. We were just uh, announcing that the jailer didn't have to commit suicide because he was um, able to see that the prisoners were still intact in the darkest part of the prison. So he didn't have to lose his life. Paul called him and let him know it's okay. Glory, hallelujah. The healing of the lame man in the book of Acts uh, 3 and 1 and 26. That also Peter and John healed a man who had been a uh, cripple uh, both on their way to worship at the temple. And the, and the miracle amazed the other worshipers who crowded around the list to listen as Paul seized the occasion to preach another evangelical message. This is where I'm hoping that we as believers will gather and we will hear story from story from story about healings. And that's what I advise people that are coming on anytime for the fig tree generation blossoms and you have a testimony that you would like to share, we'd be more than happy to bring you on the live so that you can share your testimony. We're very much interested in knowing what God is doing in your life. Uh, Amazing Grace Outreach Ministry is an outreach that is from nation to nation. We are a congregation that is all over the world. We have planted churches in India. We also have those in Africa that um, have a mer Amazing Grace Outreach Ministries also. We have um, honor, honor affiliates as Dr. Etta, um, Bernard Etta, in, uh, he was in Cameroon, but now he's in Tanzania. We thank God for all the men and women that have been uh, partakers of this particular mantle that has been set in the earth. We thank God for the face-to-face uh, -face radio. As most of you know, we can bring your music to this platform and we can give complete visibility to your talent and your gift and your product. That is our outreach a promotional ministry that we are now um, promoting the shop where now as we have been uh, having the celebrities like LL Cool J to bring their new um, products like he has a collection of figurines, uh, boxing and hip hop, and uh, we do a show, we do a showcasing and featuring various celebrities' product songs. Also, email me if you have a song that you like us to promote and run. Also, we are interested in having people to come tell what God is doing. Most of all, we want to win souls on Instagram. Facebook Live, there's a multitask of things that can happen and be possible for us there. And uh, we also have LinkedIn. Some of you have joined me and um, have been able to connect with me through LinkedIn. My uh, newest pages and groups would be the YouTube. YouTube, we have three channels. One uh, for specifically uh, promotions, music, artists gospel music artists most of all and then we have the teaching page where we're talking about uh, roots and branches and the fig tree generation and then we have amazing grace page from uh, videos where we produced in the studios and we had different events so with those three uh, we would love for you to uh, check us out those that you enjoy please share them also we are going to have more content and more people producing. That is really what we're interested in, spreading the gospel news, but also we're interested in people um, that need to make a, a living. We're interested in having uh, sponsors on some of the events and sponsors like an entertainment to come out here for World Festival to bring some entertainment to this city to um, bring us and saturate us with an opportunity to hear the voices and, and uh, singing of gospel artists. 
Amen. We want to really make sure before the year is over, we have some concrete plans about that. So I have pretty much told you everything that I can think that's that's kind of hot on the topic tonight. I hope that you will join me again. Rock Lito joined us and over here on Facebook Live, I see I see people's but I don't see names, so I can't call you out because your name is not there. But I do appreciate you coming on. You have just been a part of every miracle in the Bible. You've just been a part of the um, roots and branches that we have three sessions. We had three sessions today. We also learned a little bit about how to handle uh, times when we uh, realize that it's, it's not our fight. It's time for us to just wait on the Lord and let him handle the battle because it belongs to him. Amen. We played songs from um, some of the legendary uh, music artists like Alvin Slaughter. Love that song, Rain Down. Uh, we do not own the rights to the music. We are promoters and we are doing inspiration. Okay, have a good evening and check me out on Instagram. Tag and share. Amen.